So the focus of our report is on teachers and we're looking at um, the degree to which uh, districts have a hard time staffing. What we're trying to do is get our heads around how are teachers distributed across different kinds of districts, how are different kinds of kids accessing instructional resources, and what are the local policies that have been put into place that might help to alleviate staffing shortages or help kids have access to higher quality teachers. There is a, a fair degree of inequity in terms of the, the sorting of, of teachers across students. Uh, I think that people are going to be interested in the extent to which there are real challenges to um, hire and retain teachers in particularly in certain areas and for certain kinds of school systems. So as a parent of kids who go to public school, I think a lot about the teachers. In fact, what we know is that teachers matter more than any other school-based input for kids' education and, and their outcomes and their long-term outcomes later in life. And so I always want to think about what are the working conditions that are facing the teachers that teach our kids and how can we improve those working conditions. There are lots of questions that we would like to answer uh, and either because of the structure of the data or the degree to which data um, can be released to researchers, we can't answer those questions. And it's not just that we can't answer those questions. The questions can't right now be answered in California very easily. And I think that that's actually this non-finding is one of the very important findings for the study um, that we don't have a system that allows you to assess policies and practices and that to me seems fundamental for improvement in the system.